Okay, ready to start? Good morning from Bing, Germany to everybody around the world. Thank you for joining us. Max Schröder and me, Philipp von Senden, are delighted that people out of nearly 30 different countries have announced to attend this webinar today. During the next approximately 15 minutes, we will present the Colibri 50 to you, one of the newest products of Broadcast Solutions. If you have any questions about the system, please put them in the chat or the QA section. Mark will check already all the incoming questions during our demo. We will try to answer them after the presentation or get back to you after the live session. Let's start with some footage. The Colibri 50 is the smallest and lightest three-dimensional flying aerial camera system on the market. It is constructed to fly especially in small indoor venues. Just like the bird, the system has fantastic flight skills and a working area up to 50 by 50 meters. So if you have had the issue before that you wanted to create dynamic pictures in your lo uh, but your location was too small to fly inside with one of the conventional bigger systems or you have had the budget only for a camera crane, we have the solution now for you. The Colibri system is able to fly in the smallest venues and cost less than most of camera cranes. With its size and flexibility, it enables you to create precise and impressive shots without any limitations. Why is it possible to fly within smallest venues like new studios, for example? It starts with a special dimension and flexibility of the winches. Here you can see one of the winches in front of us. They are small, light. We are talking about a weight of approximately 90 kg per winch. Very special is the possibility to install them under the ceiling, for example on a truss, if you have limited floor space. So as you can see, you have two different setup options. You can place them on the ground. Normally we wanted to show you a graphic where you can see the setup options. Now you can see it, okay. Um, there are the two different setup options. You can place them on the ground as usual, as you can see on the left side in the picture, or you can put the, uh, the winches up on the trusses in the height. So that gives you the possibility to hold the stage free. Let's get to the ropes now. Two of the four steel ropes have fiber cable inside for signal transmission and control of the gimbal. The other two ropes and this is very special too, include the power supply for the gimbal. So there are no batteries necessary on top of the dolly anymore. This is another great advantage that leads to a lighter gimbal with a weight of just 4.5 kg, including camera and lens. This benefit also reduces the sag of the dolly. Therefore, you can fly in the flattest then use nearly directly under the roof if necessary. Also, you don't have to do any kind of battery change anymore during a production. By the way, we deliver the system including a Blackmagic 4K studio camera and an Olympus zoom lens. Tally lights are mounted around the gimbal top with the option to choose between different colors. Let's talk about the next interesting point, the pulleys. The, uh, the pulleys can be installed just at pipes, as you can see here. So you don't need any big and heavy truss constructions anymore. But last not le but not least, before we start answering your questions, let's talk about the operator panels and the software. As you can see in the picture, the system can be operated by two people. The camera operator, sitting here on the right side, and um, the pilot on the left side who's also managing the software. The software is nearly self-explaining. It offers you the possibility to fly manually, automated or to program repeatable flights. Furthermore, the system is already augmented reality ready. Here you can see a few augmented reality graphics we used during our Broadcast Innovation Day last year. Please note, this is not a monitor hanging in our hall. It is a live augmented reality graphic. 
To resume, why should you decide to purchase a Colibri 50? What are the huge advantages and the unique selling points? It's the lightest and smallest 3D aerial camera system on the market. You have got nearly no cable sack anymore. You have nearly no shadow. A 4K 6G camera is also, uh, already integrated in the system. It is augmented reality ready. It is cheaper and more beneficial than every other camera crane. And of course the system is DECRA certified and has all the necessary safety certifications to, do, to be allowed to fly over people. That brings us to the end of our presentation. Um, so we will be able to answer your questions, if you have got questions. Mark, yes. have you received the I have, questions? I have one question here. Uh, with which augmented graphics systems does it work? Uh, nearly with everyone that you, that you know from the market, with, with Wiz Engine, Trackman, we, we did the, the pictures um, last year at the BID with a Trackman system together with Zero Density. Yes, okay. Um, what is the best use case for such a small system? Oh, there are lots of, of possibilities. Um, one special use case, for example, is um, to use it in, in uh, news studios, for example, a broadcast uh, station from Korea already integrated one system in their studio in Korea, in Seoul. Um, in, and others, there are other studios uh, around the world who already integrated it. So I think if you have got an indoor studio or an indoor venue with about yeah, a flying area of 50 by 50 or maximum 80 by 80 meters, it is absolutely um, yeah, perfectly constructed to, to fly in, in a venue like this. Yeah. Another interesting question came in, ju just dropped in now. Is the system only for fixed installation? Of course not. You can also mount it um, as a flexible system, like we have it here, or you can do the fixed installation. Both is possible, without issues. Right. Any further questions? Is yeah. it safe to fly over people? That's one one point we already had, it is uh, DECA certified with a DGUV 17 slash 18. So it is absolutely safe to fly over people and uh, certified safe. And we have steel ropes holding much, much more than the 4.5 right. kilo dolly. Exactly. Something maybe what we can show again, the steel rope, as you can see here again. Yeah. Brings you up to a safer point, of course. Okay, I guess this was the last question. Maybe, in, maybe, maybe in addition, um, we are we have been flying already, for example, in France, and that's very special. Only with one rope. Normally, you are only allowed to fly in France with a double rope system, but this system um, has been certified from Bureau Veritas in France, uh, and they they allowed us at the only one system at all in France. Uh, by now that was allowed to fly with only single rope because of this steel rope. Mm -hmm. They said that's very safe. Any, any other questions, Mark? No. Okay, since there are no more questions coming in, we will end the session here. If you have any further questions or if you need any more information, please do not hesitate to contact Mark or me. We are looking forward to hearing from you. Thanks a lot. Stay healthy and bye-bye.